So I'm Dr. Balaji Jagannath. I'm a practicing physician diabetologist at the Apollo Sugar Clinics in Bangalore. Uh, I'm happy to be here at Diabetes India, where uh, I've given a talk on the heart being an endocrine organ and an endocrine target for therapy. Now you know that uh, I mean, apart from the endocrine system that releases a lot of uh, hormones, the heart also has a small role as an endocrine organ. So there are certain substances or certain hormones called the ANP, BNP, atrial natriuretic and brain natriuretic peptides and certain biomarkers like NT pro BNP, uh, GDF15 or even myostatin. So these are all part of the endocrine function of the heart uh, which has various functions in the body. Primarily they are involved in conditions like acute coronary syndrome, a myocardial infarction or heart failure. In heart failure, many of these natriuretic peptides are released. Now, if you take a look at uh, ANP and BNP per se, the function in the body is to eliminate the water and the sodium through the kidney. So they are released in states where there is a strain on the atria and the ventricular of the heart, especially when there is an increase in afterload and preload, the volume increases. So automatically they are released and they're also metabolized and cleared very quickly so that they can eliminate whatever water and sodium and try to, uh, try to establish the hemodynamic stability. Uh, there are certain drugs called uh, ARNES, which is angiotensin receptor blocker and neprilysin inhibitors. Now these have been recently introduced in the management of heart failure. Uh, it is seen that if you give these drugs, on one hand it will activate the, the, the peptide system and on the other hand it will inhibit the angiotensin receptor blocker. So the end result is the elimination of fluid and sodium from the body. So that leads to a decrease in blood pressure and a decrease in the volume overload. The NT pro BNP like I said is a biomarker which has been recommended by most of the international cardiac guidelines. Uh, as a screening tool for heart failure, it can be for de novo heart failure, someone who already has chronic heart failure or even when they are hospitalized for uh, an acute decompensatory episode. So I think the uh, natriuretic peptide system which is secreted from the heart is a very important system that is involved in fluid uh, and electrolyte uh, uh, regulation and drugs that act on this system will be very helpful especially in conditions like heart failure uh, which will help improve the mortality and probably improve the survival rates in many patients. Thank you.